Hi guys, welcome back. We're here, this is our D, this is Cyclops. This is the ID that we're going to use to start playing with this JV Hair thing. The first thing that we, need, that we need is actually, it's not mandatory, but it's a good thing to have the JV Hair plugin installed. So, what we have to do is to go to help, installing software, and yada yada yada, and in work with, we have to input this address, jvhave.org slash reference slash eclipse slash updates we have to check on this checkbox next finish next 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 and that's it i already installed it that's why i'm not gonna do it again but i'm gonna show you i'm gonna prove you <laughs> that i have it already installed in a few minutes one thing that i didn't said before that i didn't say before sorry is that we're gonna use maven for this so what we have to do we have to have Maven installed previously. If you don't know how to do it, please ask me and I'm gonna give you a hand with that. It's really easy. If I did it, that means that everybody can, can do it. So what we have to do is create new Maven project, new other Maven project. Next, I don't care about the location. Sure, why not? Let's go to JB Have Course. Uh, Behave Course. Let's do the package with this, this name. Finish. Okay. Ta da! Here is a project. The most important thing about this is the bum. If we take a look at it, it's pretty empty. It has nothing, just JUnit, and that's pretty much it. I'm going to show you another bomb that I have here in this other project that I've been creating for you guys. So let me show you what does this bomb have. Bom. It has also the Maven version, JUnit version. Log for J, we're going to use, use this to, to log. Oh, this and G doesn't matter. Um, we can use it or we cannot, it doesn't matter, it's, it's up to you guys. JV Hub version, this is the last one currently. Selenium, we're going to use Selenium to test the UI. Rest Assured, Rest Assured is a library that we, we use to test REST services. If you haven't tried it before, trust me, this is the easiest way to to test these services because this library is really 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 helpful and it's really easy to use and Groovy this is gonna help us on our on our um, report okay so what we're gonna to do we're gonna cheat a little, little bit we're gonna copy this yada 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 and we're gonna paste it on the brand new pump this one, take it, take it. Ta -da! Now we have, now we have our own private JV Hive Palm with all the things that, all the things that we need. As I said before, this test ng we can't really delete it, so that's what we're going to do. Oh. Test ng, taka taka, or ignore me. Where is where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Here it is. Let's delete it. Let's save this and let's delete this dependency. Alright. As I said before, now we have the pump with the things that we need just at least for startups. JBHave, Selenium, Rest Assured, and Groovy. Let's create. Let's okay. We have this package, JBHave course, we're gonna we can totally delete this thing. Yeah, sure, why not? Are you sure? Yes. You know what? I am sure. Under this, we're gonna create a new package. The first package is stories. In case you haven't figured it out, this is the package where we're going to where, where, where we're going to create the stories. Or input the stories or put the stories. The second package. 
steps. Guess what we are we going to put there? And the last one, we're going to call it, I don't know, let's call it mapper. Okay, in case that if you haven't figured, figured it out yet, under stories, we're going to put our story files, the steps, our step files, bravo, and mapper, here we're going to put all the classes that are going to call our story files, and our step files, and basically, those classes are the ones who are run are going to run our tests. Okay, so let's start with basics. Let's create our first story. And now is where this JVH plugin is going to start playing. New, other, JVH. We didn't have this before. We start having it after we install this plugin. So, new story. Next, let's call it our first test. Our first automated test case, or first ATC. Alrighty then. This is pretty much, this is pretty much how JVH looks. Let's delete this. I'm gonna have just one scenario. Here's the title. A narrative. This is often, often here it goes the description of the story. Of the story that we're going to test. And under scenario, we're gonna write a brief description of the test case. For instance, uh, I don't know the scope of this test is to open Google. That's it. We can delete all this just to make it as easier for us to I don't know to understand. As I said on the on a couple of videos before, this whole behavior-driven development has some structure given, when, then. Under given, we're going to write our precondition. For instance, given I open a browser, when. I enter HTTP colon slash slash triple w google.com that's the situation and the outcome is then I don't know Google is displayed Google is displayed Save it, and we just wrote our first story file. We just wrote our first test case. So the only thing that we, that we need for now is to write the steps. We're going to be in Java. J behave J us in Java, and then create the file that is going to call this story, map it with the steps, and is gonna execute it, and eventually we're gonna have we're gonna have a report. This is it for now. On the next video, we're gonna start writing the steps. Bye bye. See you in the next video.